Back to another Kraken Packs video. I am your host, Miss Rivers. That's right, we're back with a very special episode of Kraken Packs, and that is these are sponsored bundles. So these bundles were purchased by none other than Stubborn Salmon himself. Um, he asked me to purchase them and uh, open them up for him on my channel. And uh, basically, uh, anything over two dollars he wants sent to him. Uh, other than that, uh, you guys get to see me open it for him. So he's hoping that uh, he gets to prove me wrong, I think, is the idea here. He gets to prove me wrong and say, no, nope, there are totally masterpieces in Aether Revolt, and you're just super unlucky, Mr. Rivers. And I mean, like, don't have to really prove to me that I'm unlucky, but because I'm well aware. <laughs> I am well aware. That's like, what is it? Never lucky, always lucky? Is that how it works? Never lucky, always lucky, right? So, of course, you're not getting the die because I'm not shipping that to you. And it's not over $2, so that's fine. And you're not getting the land pack or the quick thing and all that. So we're going to keep this box here like this. And we'll put that away. Like so. So we're going to keep this box here and we'll put your cards into that box for now just so that I can keep track. And so let's get right in. Should I, should I open up the other? What do you think? Should I get the other bundle and get the packs out? I feel like I should. I feel like I should. Rather than doing them one at a time. Let's, let's, let's get both of them. Because we're opening them both on this video. We're going to open both of them on this video. And they're both for Stubborn Salmon. So, there's no need to, like, worry about, you know, mixing them together. Because they're all going to the same place. Maybe what we need to do is, like, take these dies out and take this stuff out, put it into the other box. Maybe that's the best plan. Open. Open, says me. <laughs> oh, you heard it. It all... It farted. I'm sorry, everyone. Okay. There's that. And then we can put this in here. This is... It should fit in there. There we go. Nice. Now we have a nice little box where we can kind of keep track of everything for you. Okay, so this was the second bundle, so we're going to put it face up. So we'll do the first bundle first, so that way you guys can still see the difference. So first bundle, here's the packs. Let's get into them. And this is how Stubborn Salmon likes it, so he likes it super fast. Checked. No. Okay. No. Foil, though. A nice foil Hungry Flames. Token and land. Quicksmith Rebel is not something that you want. That's for sure. Who here thinks that we're going to get one of these fancy dancy things for Stubborn Salmon? I'm going to guess that you all think we will. Aid from the Cowl and a Mountain and a Garbage Card. Two packs in. Nothing super interesting yet. Let's see. Treasure Keeper. Alright. Merchant's Dockhand. Again, nothing. Nothing super fancy there. Treasure Keeper again. Gonti's Machinations. Per uh, Perilous Predicament. Heroic Intervention. That's a $10 card. Boom. I guess... We'll put your pile here. You're getting foils and you're getting uh, cards over $2, right? So, Heroic Intervention. So, if you don't know who Stubborn Salmon is, uh, he's a friend of mine who uh, sort of started his channel around the same time as me. And then he kind of uh, took a break. And uh, I actually met up with him in uh, his hometown um, for PAX Unplugged. Uh not this past year, but the year before it. And we got to hang out. We did a couple box battles um, here and there over the over the year, over the years, I guess. 
And so uh, he contacted me and was like, I want you to open up some bundles of Aether Revolt for me. And I was like, sure, I can do that. Release the Gremlins. Release them. Release them. Energy token. So two foils and a Heroic Intervention. Okay, okay. I mean, Heroic Intervention is a good card. I mean, I didn't know it was at $10 now. It's pretty crazy. Ironclad Revolutionary, Monstrous Onslaught, Renegade Wheelsmith, and another Merchant's Dockhand. But, foil rare, foil were of invention. All right. Nothing super fancy to write home about there, but it is a foil rare. So you've hit three foils out of this first bundle. I mean, not terrible. Not terrible. Okay, Outland Boar, Gremlin Infestation. Hungry Flames, and a Glint Sleeve Siphoner. Is is Glint Sleeve Siphoner somewhere on the list? No. And we gotta make sure that we keep an eye out for Gifted Aetherborns. And another foil! Wow. A foil Sweatworks Brawler. Four foils in one bundle is pretty crazy. That seems like a high number. Salvage Scuttler, Deadeye Harpooner, Crackdown Construct and Rishkar's Expertise. Two dollars. Two dollars for that. So put it into the pile. We haven't hit any fatal push. Oh, Word of Invention is actually a three dollar rare. So that foil rare is actually not bad. Okay. Sweet. That's pretty sweet. Outland Boar, Spire Patrol, Siege Modification, and Spire of Industry. Is Spire of Industry on this list? It's not. It's a good land. No foil. So, servo token and a forest. Well, first bundle, not terrible. What is, uh, so what is, no, not that, this one. Um, so what is the foil were going for? Foil were of inventions going for $10 right now on TCG. So there you go. That's pretty sweet. Okay, we're going to put you up there. And then we'll put these down here. Okay, second bundle time. Second bundle time. Oh, let's just double check here. I don't think we saw any of the uncommons of note because we're looking at uncommons are uh, Fatal Push and Gifted Aetherborn. And I don't think... I put them all in a big pile. But I don't think we saw any of them. They're both black, so it's pretty easy to tell just by doing a quick scan here. No. No, 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 okay, no, we didn't hit any of them, so we don't have to worry too much, that's good, all right, we didn't skip anything, all right, Salmon, so it all comes down to this, man, second bundle, what do you think, we're gonna get there, let's find out, let's find out, Invigorated Rampage, Spire Patrol, Siege modification and heroic intervention again. All right, another ten dollar rare. Okay, so you've hit three ten dollar rares. You've made your money back on one of these bundles so far. Pretty much, pretty close, pretty close to your money back on one of these bundles. Cogwork assembler, Gonti's machination, reverse engineer, and solemn recruit with a forest and a goblin token. All right. We want to see a walking ballista, right? We want to see a walking ballista and maybe uh, a metallic mimic or like a brawl. It'd be all right. Salvage Scuttler, Renegade Harpooner, Windkin Raiders. Okay, we'll take a Paradox Engine. That's a $30 rare. So there you go. Almost your money back. Almost your money back now. You're sitting at like 60 bucks. Sitting at 60 bucks, and that's US. So, I mean, Malfist Revolutionary, Feldir Guardian, Pacification Array, and Rishkar. Rishkar, I don't think, is on the list. Rishkar's expertise is on the list, but Rishkar is not. That's garbage. That's a garbage token. Why is it in my token pile? Get out of here, garbage token. All right. I mean, we'll take the Paradox Engine for sure, right? Untethered Express, Aerial Modification, Maverick Thopterist, and Consulate Crackdown. No foil again. 
Whoop, wrong pile. Lands there, tokens there. All right, five packs left. Five packs left. We didn't hit a mythic in the first bundle either, so that's kind of weird. But we did hit a foil rare, so I guess I mean I guess it makes up. We hit a decent foil rare. Let's put it that way. I guess that's Rogue Refiner, Invigorated Rampage, Sly Requisitioner, and Rishkar's Expertise. Another two dollar rare. Another two dollar rare. All right. And we haven't hit any of the uncommons either, so no Fatal Push and no G Gifted Aetherborn, which is kind of weird too, right? Malfist Revolutionary, Ironclad Revolutionary, Barricade Breaker, and a second mythic, Indomitable Creativity. Not uh, not on the list of dollar value-wise, but we'll put it in the pile. And our first foil from this bundle, which is a precise strike. That's the other thing too, is like we hit, what, four foils in the first bundle and we only hit one so far? In this one? So it's like super unbalanced, as you can see. All right. Untethered Express, Ridge Scaled Tusker, Hidden Stockpile, and Quicksmith Spy. All right. So you got the Rebel and the Spy, just in different bundles. Double Mythic, though. Double Mythic bundle. So, all right. We'll take it. We got a Rogue Refiner and a Fatal Push, finally. So there you go. $3 uncommon now. It has come down quite a bit in price. Scrap Trawler. Again, another uh, rare similar to the last box. This is kind of interesting. Okay. Last pack. Last pack magic, right? Deadeye Harpooner. Ornithopter. Consulate Dreadnought. And Pia's Revolution. With nothing. See? I told you. You tried to convince me, Salmon, that there were inventions in this set. And I... Look at that. We just opened 20 packs and didn't see a single one. That being said, you didn't do too bad. You didn't do too bad. So we'll take those away and we'll take a look here. So you've got... Double copy of Rishkar Expertise. $2 rare. Right? $3 Fatal Push. Right? You've got a couple foils here. you got a Mythic worth... Not a whole heck of a lot, right? You got a bunch of foils. You got a War of Invention worth 10. Heroic Intervention worth 10. Heroic Intervention worth 10. And you've got a Paradox Engine worth 30. So you've got 30, 60, and then about another, what? Eight bucks? Six bucks? Somewhere in there they have three and... Yeah, so seven. Seven dollars. So you get $67 worth of value back, essentially. Close to it, anyway. So that's not terrible. And Double Mythic. I mean, not... Indomitable Creativity is not super crazy, but it's not terrible. So there you go, Salmon. I hope... I hope it was worth it for you. I mean, now I gotta do something with all this bulk. What am I gonna do with all of this? I don't know what I'm gonna do with it all. I mean, I know what I'm going to do with it all. I'm going to put it into a box with all of the other bulk. But, like, what am I going to do with that box? Because I've got plenty of them. <laughs> I'll figure something out. I'll figure something out. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, everybody. I've been your host, Mr. Rivers. This has been a special opening for Stubborn Salmon himself. He bought these two Aether Revolt bundles and asked me to open them on my channel. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much, Stubborn Salmon, for allowing me to open your product for you. I really appreciate it. If you are interested in having me open product for you and have the cards of de dollar value and note sent to you, you can check out my Patreon, where I, I do do that, where you can sign up for a bundle or a booster box. But you can also sign up for things that are just like grab bags and things like that. And uh, those grab bag tiers, you get a grab bag of cards uh, every month, along with a discount code to my store, nerdvanastore.ca, where I sell a whole bunch of singles and stuff. So, you know, check that out. And if you're wondering what other kind of rewards patrons get, well, they get a thing from the patron pile, and the patron pile is pretty spicy. Uh, you know my videos I do on Wednesdays, One of Everything Wednesdays. If you've never seen those, you should check them out. Um, they are uh, a bunch of packs from stores in and around my area. I open them up. Anything of a dollar or more in value goes into the patron pile, and every patron who rolls over month to month in my MTG tiers gets one pull from that pile every month added to their grab bag so it's pretty sweet anyway check it out if you don't if you can't support with the monetary value don't even worry about it thanks for just being here and watching i really appreciate it i hope you all have a magical day and as always may your pulls ever be better